Hello, Earth Signs. Welcome to the Manjula Awakening. Let's see what is the most important message deemed by Spirit at this time. What's going on for the Earth Sign, Spirit? This is Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, Venus, as well as any South Node placements. Thank you. It says wanted universe creators. Okay. Uh, and subconsciously, it says, I am a gal galactic starseed blooming. Wow. And oh, my goodness. And then consciously spirit is asking you, uh, is telling you that your effortless effort is required now. So the message that I'm getting from this, to be honest, I don't even know how to place this because there's so much to look at in all of these cards. Um, so much to look at in all of these cards. So let's see. Let's talk about it, Spirit. So Spirit is wanting you to know that you're wanted. You're needed. You have been preparing for this for a long, long time. Not just this. Um, I'm going to say this lifetime because if you're here, then I feel like that you believe in past lives. And, and if you don't, then you then your life has been rocky. And you've been preparing for this very moment. There, it, anything that has happened to you has not been by mistake. Um, everything has been because you are blooming. Like you are about to shine so brightly through um, just being naturally who you are. Naturally who you are. Not what your mom and pops have put into you. Not what your bro and sis has put into you. But just what you have learned because where you have hit your head and nobody's been there to rock you back to health or whatever the case may be you've had to do that on your own so it's like just keep unfortunately it's like just keep doing what you're doing you not don't do nothing different don't choose to be different now because everything that you've been that you have endured up until this moment is for this moment don't doubt that it says fulfill your destiny as a cosmic change maker exactly don't change that i need you right now don't let the universe down now let's see this is for earth signs capricorn taurus virgo what does spirit what does capricorn taurus to virgo need to know right now spirit what is the situation what is the situation thank you spirit restriction yeah see you hold and looky here i love this card <laughs> i love this card because i have taurus twins in the spirit realm and um anytime that i feel like that i am mentally trapped i do i feel like and i pull this card i feel like that it's them telling me mommy you didn't lose me for don't if you stop now then you losing me was in vain so here i'm about to get you out i'm gonna help you get out you know like somebody's coming to set you free from your own self limitations, but you're scared of what you're being set free. You're, you're scared of what it's like to be set free from what you're used to being chained to. But you have to make the decision to appreciate the change. No matter what, you have to make the decision to appreciate the change. Oh, Lord, look here. Appreciate the change. And to remain uh, disciplined because behind discipline is victory. So let's keep going, spirit. Let's keep going, spirit. What's the challenge here? What's the challenge for the earth sign? Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. What's the challenge, spirit? Thank you. So we have purpose. The challenge is. Uh, let me see. <laughs> okay, so I'm getting two storylines, and they're almost coming through just as loudly as, as one another. Let me say the first one first. It's almost as if it's going to, like, the challenge is the right decision seems too easy and you and okay so for the other ones 
it's like once you are like once spirit sets you free mentally from your own limitations you have to go on another on an unbeaten path and just know that okay so this might be spirit with this bouquet right here this is spirit saying here's a preview of what you're getting but you're not going to see that along the path you just have to trust because i the divine i'm speaking for the divine i am not the divine it's not what i'm saying but the spirit is saying trust me because i gave you this book i gave you a preview of where you're headed you may not see it right now but remain in this attitude of appreciation and pleasure because this is the way this is how to address the challenge it, this is this trust that that you that those flowers are a preview of what you're going into look at the way it is on the desk he's walking into this flowers he's walking straight into that so if the the journey might not be easy the purpose uh the mission um The journey may be a struggle. The journey may not always be peaceful. Why is purpose in the challenge position here, Spirit, for the earth signs? I just heard too stubborn. So you don't want to let, you have to let something go. You do have to let something go. In order for, in order to be set free from this restriction, What is holding you back from progressing forward was serving as a restriction. Once you're set free from that, because it's tied to something of pleasure as well. Because you willingly, now you might be trapped in your mind, but you are willingly facing that direction. You are not facing this purpose. So Spirit, show me, show me this. Why is purpose here in the challenge position for earth signs? Thank you. It's in you and let go and bury. Hoo, hoo, hoo. This is letting me know that you already know deep down within you what it is that you're holding on to, that you expect something external to you to pay the price. Like, pi like, what is it? Pi Piper uh, is it's time to pay the Piper or something like that. Um, and you are expecting somebody like, you know what I'm saying? you but it's it's it's, it's got to let that go it, that is affecting you from uh serving your mission it's like it's stopping you from completely blooming and it's time for you just to do what's natural because you trying to make somebody pay for what they did to you does not come natural it does not come effortlessly and it says your effortless effort is fully required and so there's and, and that's consciously so, and then we have let go and bury. So, all right. Oh, um, look at me jumping straight to the. Let me not short change the earth signs. Right, spirit how is the collective showing up right now or not the collective i'm sorry how are their earth, earth signs capricorn taurus virgo how are they currently showing up under this situation thank you spirit um the six of uh, the harmony card um damn the lovers card the two of cups okay earth signs so you are ready to make a decision like you're needing to make a decision you're, you're needing to allow and it's time to let your soul be your navigation. It's time to allow your soul to become your navigation. You can't overthink this right now, Earth Signs. 
there the, yeah there's a need to allow this is Gemini energy by the way huh Allow your soul to do your navigation. Yeah. Absolutely. Definitely have to allow your soul to do the navigation. Earth signs, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, Venus, um, South Node. There's this energy right here of what you're not seeing is that everything that you're going to sacrifice to acquire these four of cups behind him, which look wonderful, look beautiful, look like enough to take care of me and my family, honey. But he's still not happy. So just imagine what he had to do to acquire all of that just for you still not to be happy. Still to be looking in the past or, you know, still to be looking out for something better. I promise you. Um, this is the energy of uh, learning to value and appreciate the journey. The journey. Don't just get lost on the, um, you know, um, uh, ooh. you're focused on a person. There's a lot of love here. You're focused on a person. You're being you're 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 being told to um, cut loose from a person. You're being called to cut loose from a person because you are you are calling this person in, and this person still has no desire to look in this direction. And when this person does begin to 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 drift your way subconsciously they um the moment that you put off this energy of uh okay i'm gonna work with you or okay then this person is still it, it's like okay well i still got you okay it's like this person prematurely drifts off so you have to you have to you have to go about your business you have to go there was one two three four when i looked at her it's you have to go about your business you got to move forward with love. You can't, you can't, you, you can't focus on, um, you can't stay tied to a person at the expense of your life purpose. You cannot do that. You cannot do that. Yeah. And so what you're not seeing is the universe is bringing this back into balance. The universe is calling bullshit for you earth signs. That are staying stuck in a situation because of uh i don't know maybe you got into a situation because you were after pentacle abundance but it, you didn't realize that going after abundance that it would leave you in lack of e like a lack of emotional fulfillment knowing good damn well that i feel like that as much water is here I feel like that there is a strong, strong element of water to whoever's watching this. And so this you require a lot of emotional um, nurturing. Like, I feel like that you can show up in a pentacle. Yes, absolutely. I feel like that you, this, that this, who am I on? I'm on earth sign. That's why it's not making sense. Thank you, spirit. Uh, yes, you got the earth taken down like you got it under control But it's like you over flood and oversaturate your soil your earth because you need nurturance as far as it pertains to emotions So damn. So what you're not understanding is the universe is coming in to clear this out and the air sign is what was throwing me off because I said and this is Gemini by the way um and yeah so air is here so I do feel as if that uh, there's going to be this uh, sudden balancing of it's like you're going to be made to see what you got you're going to see something you're going to see what you had or you're going to see what you got I don't know what the tense of that is okay you're gonna see what you got 
You're going to see what you have so that you can uh, take this leap of faith. You're going to see where you've been holding yourself back or where you've been not appreciating certain things in your life. Earth signs. Uh, you've been trying too hard and not... Yeah, you've been trying too hard to acquire that you haven't been given back. You haven't been given back. All right, Spirit. I hope you followed that message, Earth Signs. Let's see. What's the closing message? Uh, enjoy the tranquility of water. Get to the water. That's how you nurture yourself. Stop relying on external people to nurture you emotion, uh, emotionally. Get yourself into the water, uh, close to some water and air, and allow yourself to take that in. So I'm going to say in this instance, nope. A bath or a shower isn't just going to do. You need to get out into the water in the air. But anyways, let me see. It says to remove stress, immerse yourself in a soothing bath. Walk near a body of water or gently splash water on your face. And then we also have practice patience. Press the pause button. Take a day off from being frustrated with yourself or others. Patience reaps great reward. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have embrace your imperfections. Release the idea that you must be without flaws. Humans are imperfect, messy, and also miraculous. miraculous. Simply aim to be the best person possible. Guys, I pray that these messages provided you with some guidance on your journey. If these messages did resonate, then we would absolutely appreciate a thumbs up down below. Help get these messages out to other people in need. And in all that we say and in all that we do moving forward, let's choose peace. Love and light, guys.